What's going on, everybody? Uh, I'm gonna start off by saying, "Auntie, excuse me, I got a bit of a head cold." I uh, I got a hold of my friend, most of you know Justin Wolf, yesterday. I noticed he hadn't been very active on the uh, the Facebook group for a few days, so I got a hold of him to check on him, see how he was doing, and kind of find out he's really, really sick. And then I woke up. That was yesterday, and I woke up today, and now I'm sick. So that rat bastard got me sick. Through the telephone. Through the cell phone. He's an awesome guy. But, anyway, uh, I just want to go over something real quick. Kind of my thoughts on uh, serrations. As most of you guys know, I, I do most of my stuff from my cell phone. And I started uploading these YouTube videos. Well, I don't get notifications that people comment on my videos. So today, and I'm kind of technologically dumb. So today I got on there and I was looking and I seen there's all kinds of comments on my videos that I hadn't seen before so I was trying to play catch up and read them all. But I noticed one uh, friend of mine, uh, Magnus Anderson, most of you know him. And if you don't know him, you should know him. He's like one of the coolest guys I know. But uh, I said something about serrations in one of my videos and he commented something along the lines of like, am I the only one that likes serrations? Um, you know, he made the joke that like he's messed up in the head or something. Uh... Oh, Magnus, you're not, well, you may be messed up in the head, I don't know, but you're not messed up in the head because you like serrations, and I'm going to kind of go over why I think you like serrations, and a bunch of us, not saying we don't like serrations, but we don't prefer serrations. I think the reason you like serrations is because you're left-handed. Uh, I'm right-handed. I mean, I'm not saying I don't like serrations. Um, they do great at cutting rope. Uh cardboard stuff like that but i don't really prefer them on a uh a bushcrafting well outdoors woodsy knife just for the simple fact that <clears throat> uh one of the main things you use your uh knife for is to make curls or feather sticks or whatever for fire prep well i have an easier time making better curls with a on a plain edge knife instead of a serrated knife and I think a lot of the other guys uh, are kind of in the same boat. And like I said, I think it's because you're left-handed. And I think it's, I don't prefer them because I'm right-handed. I'm going to show you why I think that. If you look on a serrated knife, they're kind of the same concept. The serrations are kind of the same concept as a chisel grind. I don't know if a lot of you guys know what a chisel grind knife is. Most knives have two bevels that come to a point. Well, chisel grind, one side's flat, and then just one side's beveled. So, like, one side's flat and the other side's beveled. So, it's only got, like, comes to a really sharp edge. And those knives are really great for uh, slicing and probably making feather sticks. They probably do really good for curls and feather sticks. I've never used one for that. But if you look, serrations are the same way. They're flat on this side, and then on the other side is where they're beveled. Or where the where the angle is and if you look most knives uh, that are serrated right off the top of my head I can't think of any that I haven't seen like this but they're always on the same side of the blade they're always on I don't know if you look at it they're on like this left side of the blade so if you look at it as a right hander holding a serrated knife you see that we're kind of trying to work with and you could do it you can make feathers and curls with it but they don't come out as nice as a plain edge with the bevel on both sides because as you can see we're kind of trying to work with the bevel which you know makes it maybe a little bit more difficult and maybe they don't come out quite as nice but if you look as a left hander holds a serrated knife you know what I mean they've got that bevel on that side which, you know, will help you get down. You, know, you can get thinner curls. And, uh, you know, slice thinner and stuff like that. And then it helps with the bevel being like this. It helps some curls to actually curl. And, uh, you know, to curl up and curl over and, and ball up and be nice like you wanted to. Whereas this, you know, it's just, they're just going to be straight. Because they're just, they don't even really curl because you don't really have that angle. You don't have that angle for them curls to ride up on and, and come off. 
You know what I'm saying? Uh, how much truth this holds, I don't know. That's just kind of my theory on it. That's kind of how I've always looked at it. Like I said, I don't dislike serrations, but I just don't, I don't prefer them. Now, if I was had like a, you know, maybe like a tactical knife, um, like some of the knives I used when I was in the army, I liked having serrations on those because you, you know, you're always cutting. You never know what you had to cut. And if you had to cut rope or something like that, you wanted to have them serrations because they do cut thicker rope and stuff like that a lot better. But on, on just a, a plain woods knife, a uh, bushcrafty knife, outdoors knife, skin and knife, stuff like that. I think a lot of the people that prefer a plain edge over a partially serrated or full serrated edge, uh, you'll find are probably right-handed. And then uh, people like yourself, Magnus, that uh, prefer serrations are left-handed because it works better for left-handers than it does for right-handers so like i said i don't know if that's if that's the case but that's just kind of my two cents on it kind of you know i've thought about it for a while um you know i've had that idea in the past that if i could find a knife with the serrations on the other side whereas if i could use it with my right hand you know that the bevel would be up i'd probably have a totally different outlook on it but i don't i can't honestly say that i think I've ever seen a knife with the serrations on uh, the favorable side for the right hander seems like they're always on the other side but uh, I don't know if you got any input on that uh, like I said I'm just kind of throwing the idea out there maybe that's why you like it I don't know that seems to be my idea but uh that's all I got for now um, I'm gonna take my sick ass back to the couch I'm here in my fancy recording studio, a.k.a. laundry room, because my wife is pregnant and she's going through that nursing, or the nesting thing. She's cleaning the living room carpets for like the 17th time this week. It's loud out there. So I was going to hide in the laundry room. My, my little sanctuary. <laughs> but, uh, all right, if you guys got any questions, comments, whatever. Um, let me know again if you don't have me on Facebook look me up on Facebook I'm a lot easier to get a hold of that way um, I'll try to start checking the comments on the videos more now that I know that people actually comment on them and uh, maybe I'll see if I can figure out if some of you tech savvy guys can tell me how to set it to get notifications on my phone when somebody comments on one of my YouTube videos that'd be cool um, I guess that's it till... yeah that's it till later Reba Dirty, see ya.